Hey all, it's Fox. I want to talk about a concept that I think about on a regular basis, the idea of a quantum soul. The possibility that our souls continue beyond this existence indefinitely because of quantum processes I find to be intriguing, so we're going to discuss this concept today. But before we dive in, I want to invite you to subscribe. I muse about all things strange, because you know what they say, the truth is stranger than fiction. So I seek out the strange, because odds are that's where the truth is. The concept of the soul has intrigued humanity for centuries, with various cultures, religions, and philosophies offering different views on its nature and existence. Traditionally, the soul has been understood as an immaterial essence that transcends the physical body, often associated with consciousness, identity, and the afterlife. However, as scientific understanding has advanced, particularly in the fields of quantum mechanics and neurobiology, new theories have emerged that attempt to reconcile spirituality with the material world. One such theory is the notion of the quantum soul, a fascinating intersection of science, spirituality, and metaphysics that suggests the soul could be influenced by quantum processes. Quantum Mechanics – A Brief Overview To understand the concept of a quantum soul, it's essential to first grasp the basics of quantum mechanics. Quantum mechanics is the branch of physics that deals with the behavior of particles at the atomic and subatomic levels. Unlike classical physics which deals with large-scale phenomena, quantum mechanics is governed by principles that seem strange and counterintuitive to our everyday experiences. Key concepts in quantum mechanics include wave-particle duality, superposition, and entanglement. Wave-particle duality suggests that particles such as electrons and photons can behave both as particles and as waves, depending on how they are observed. Superposition states that a particle can exist in multiple states at once until it's measured or observed. Entanglement refers to the phenomenon where particles that have interacted become linked, such that the state of one particle instantaneously affects the state of another, even if they are separated by vast distances. These principles challenge the classical understanding of the physical world and open the door to possibilities that were once thought to be purely mystical or philosophical. Could quantum mechanics provide a framework for understanding the soul? This question has led some thinkers to explore the potential connections between quantum phenomena and consciousness. Theories of the Quantum Soul The idea of a quantum soul draws on several key ideas from quantum mechanics, particularly its implications for consciousness and the nature of reality. Proponents of this theory suggest that consciousness itself may be a quantum phenomenon. This does not necessarily mean that the soul is made up of particles like atoms or electrons, but rather that quantum processes could play a fundamental role in how the soul interacts with the physical world. One prominent theory linking quantum mechanics and consciousness is the orchestrated objective reduction theory proposed by theoretical physicist Sir Roger Penrose and anesthesiologist Stuart Hameroff. According to this theory, consciousness arises from quantum processes within the brain's microtubules tiny protein structures found in neurons. The theory suggests that these microtubules could be the site of quantum computations, which then give rise to conscious experience. In this view, the brain is not just a classical computer, but a quantum system, capable of interacting with non-local reality. Non-local reality is a concept in quantum mechanics suggesting that particles can influence each other instantaneously across vast distances, seemingly defying classical ideas of space and time. It challenges the notion that objects exist with definite properties independent of measurement and local interactions. This idea is primarily associated with quantum entanglement, where two or more particles become linked, meaning the state of one instantly determines the state of the other, no matter how far apart they are. This was famously demonstrated in Bell's theorem experiments, which showed that no local hidden variable theory could fully explain quantum correlations. While the orchestrated objective reduction theory focuses on the physical brain, it hints at a deeper connection between quantum processes and consciousness that could extend beyond the body. If consciousness is tied to quantum phenomena, it raises the possibility that the soul too might be influenced by or even arise from quantum processes. If consciousness is indeed a quantum phenomena, it could mean that the soul is not bound by the body, but instead exists as an eternal wave function, interacting with the fabric of reality itself. In this view, death is not an end but a transition. The quantum information that constitutes our awareness does not vanish but instead disperses into the universe, possibly retaining some form of coherence beyond the body. 
This aligns with ideas from Eastern mysticism and near-death experiences where people describe a sensation emerging with an infinite presence. If the soul is a quantum entity, it may persist in a different dimension beyond space-time, much like quantum entanglement suggests information can exist non-locally. While mainstream science remains skeptical, the implications are profound. Immortality may not mean eternal physical life, but rather the continuation of consciousness in a quantum state. If true, this could redefine our understanding of life, death, and existence itself, suggesting that the human soul encoded with the fundamental structure of reality can never truly be destroyed. Quantum Consciousness and the Soul If we accept the idea that consciousness can emerge from quantum processes, the next question is whether the soul could also be connected to quantum phenomena. Several key ideas can help bridge the gap between quantum mechanics and the concept of the soul. Non-locality and the soul. One of the most intriguing aspects of quantum mechanics is the concept of non-locality, which suggests that particles can be instantaneously connected regardless of distance. Some proponents of the quantum soul argue that this non-locality could explain the idea of a soul that transcends space and time. Just as quantum entanglement allows particles to influence each other instantaneously, the soul could be understood as a non-local entity that exists beyond the confines of the physical body potentially surviving death and interacting with the universe in ways we do not yet understand. Superposition and the Nature of the Soul The principle of superposition, where a particle exists in multiple states at once, could offer insights into the nature of the soul. If the soul is a quantum phenomena, it might be possible for it to exist in multiple states or dimensions simultaneously. This could explain various spiritual experiences such as out-of-body experiences, near-death experiences, or a sense of connection with a larger cosmic consciousness. The idea that the soul could exist in a superposition of states challenges the conventional understanding of personal identity and suggests that the soul may be far more fluid and interconnected than we currently realize. The soul as a quantum field. Some theorists propose that the soul could be understood as a quantum field that interacts with the brain and the body. In this view, the soul is not a static entity, but rather a dynamic, evolving force that exists within the quantum realm. This concept of the soul as a field aligns with the idea of an interconnected universe, where every particle and being is connected through quantum entanglement. The soul in this framework might be seen as a reflection of the interconnectedness of all things. The Role of Quantum Physics in Spirituality while quantum mechanics is often regarded as a purely scientific field, it has profound implications for spirituality in our understanding of the universe. Many spiritual traditions emphasize the idea that all things are interconnected and that consciousness transcends the individual self. These ideas resonate with the findings of quantum physics, which suggests that the universe is far more interconnected and fluid than we typically perceive. The notion of the quantum soul fits well within certain spiritual frameworks, particularly those that emphasize non-duality, interconnectedness, and the transcendence of individual identity. In this sense, quantum mechanics offers a language for understanding ancient spiritual concepts in a modern context. It allows for a more holistic view of the soul, one that acknowledges both its immaterial, transcendent nature and its connection to the physical world. Criticisms and Challenges Despite the intriguing possibilities offered by the quantum soul theory, it remains a highly speculative and controversial idea. Critics argue that quantum mechanics with its strange and counterintuitive principles cannot be directly applied to consciousness or the soul. The human brain, after all, is a warm, wet, noisy environment far removed from the ideal conditions required for quantum phenomena to occur. In this view, the brain's biological processes are governed by classical physics, not quantum mechanics. Furthermore, there is no empirical evidence to support the idea that quantum processes are responsible for consciousness or the soul. While quantum phenomena are well documented in the microscopic world, their role in the macroscopic system such as the brain remains uncertain. As a result, many scientists remain skeptical of the idea that quantum mechanics can explain the mysteries of consciousness or the existence of the soul. The quantum soul is an exciting and thought-provoking concept that bridges the gap between space and spirituality. By exploring the possibility that consciousness and the soul are connected to quantum phenomena, we open up new avenues for understanding the nature of existence. While the theory is still speculative and faces significant challenges, it raises important questions about the relationship between the material and immaterial worlds. 
Whether or not quantum mechanics can fully explain the soul remains to be seen, but the intersection of quantum physics and spirituality offers a fascinating glimpse into the mysteries of consciousness and the universe. In the end, the quantum soul invites us to expand our understanding of reality, to reconsider the nature of the self, and to explore the profound interconnectedness of all things. Whether or not science can fully prove the existence of the soul, the exploration of these ideas encourages us to remain open to the possibility that there is much more to the universe and our consciousness than meets the eye. That's all for today. If you enjoy my content, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe, leave a comment, and share it with a friend. I appreciate your support and we'll see you next time.